The performances of Nestor Cortez Jr. worry at the Yankees. Welcome Yankee fans subscribe to the channel to receive the latest news from the Yankees. The New York Yankees gave their coin to the Tampa Bay Rays yesterday afternoon, Saturday, by closing a six-point deficit to finally win by a score of 9-8. The Rays did the same thing to the Yankees last weekend. However, if the Bronx Bombers had to come back like this, it was because starter Nestor Cortez Jr. allowed six earned runs in just four and a third innings of work. The pitching coach, Matt Blake, is well aware that his Colt must do better, even if he still believes in him. He must do things well. And I think he knows the expectations of him with the way he has performed over the past two years. He was arguably the most consistent starter in the majors. So nothing that happened has changed our belief that he can bounce back. With the exception of his first two starts, Cortez Jr. struggled to have success in his opponent's third round at bats, which resulted in him having to leave games quickly. The left-hander has also given up 21 points in his last 25 innings of work. With three out of five starters on the injured list and a Clark Schmidt throwing beach balls, Cortez Jr. needs to become the number two starter he once was, taking some pressure off Garrett's shoulders. Cortez Jr., who suffered a hamstring injury during spring camp, said he felt fine. However, there is something wrong that needs to be addressed quickly. Because yes, yesterday's victory was the biggest of the season, but they won't always be able to repeat this kind of feat, especially against the leaders. Yankee fans do you think Nestor Cortez will return to have good performances in the Yankees? Leave your opinion in the comments, subscribe to the channel to receive the latest news from the Yankees.